Welcome back to the COVID Olympic Games. Our next contestant, Daniel Hall, will see how well he can abide by CDC guidelines in a normal daily task. The course, the gas station purchase. Okay, here we have a young Daniel Hall entering the gas station. Notice he does not use his hand on the handle. That is good right there. Okay, walking directly with purpose. Seems to be entering the water cooler. How quickly will he decide? Very quick decision. No reason to stay in the gas station longer than one needs to. No reason to endanger themselves. There's another customer. Up. Oh. Dan with a good sidestep, keeping that six-foot distance. Daniel's approached the cashier. This is the most difficult obstacle in the course. Of course, the transfer of goods increases the likelihood of infection, but he has made it. Now he's in the home stretch. All he has to do is get to the door. But he's not... Ladies and gentlemen, he's not going to the door. He's going to the bathroom. I don't know if he's brave or crazy or both. Okay, washing his hands. Good over under motion. Thorough. And he has made it out of the bathroom. He is back in the home stretch, but he's forgotten his water bottle. Ladies and gentlemen, without the water bottle, the mission is pointless. He goes back to get it, but no doubt the judges will knock him for that. Here he is at the door. He is at the very end of the course. And what is this? A friend. He shook his hand. That goes against all CDC guidelines, and Daniel knows what he has done. He knows that he has been disqualified. Ooh, tough break, Daniel. Well, that does it all for us here at the gas station. We're going to cut to Indianapolis, where we're going to see Jason Breyer try to mail a letter. We'll see you next time.